Hey there everyone, I'm Valkyfanoite, and welcome to Tales of Destiny. For real this time! <laughs> yeah, okay, last time, or the last episode was a little pointless, but I just had to get it out of my system. Today, we are starting this game, and uh, I'm just gonna say we're probably gonna start the game up with some... lag. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, let's go. Let's start this great game. So, this is our, this is our hero. Stan Eileron. Of course you can change his name if you want, but I usually don't like to do that in any game that I actually have the opportunity to do it. So uh, Stan is his name and I'm sticking to it. Patrol duty is so boring. Don't complain, you're getting paid to do this. Yes sir. Uh, all that's left for us is to check this storeroom. There's probably nothing in there. And there's the lag. Yeah. <laughs> nothing big though. Identify yourself! I is he dead? No, he's just sleeping. Hey, wake up! Ow! Rough awakening. What do you think you're doing here? Uh, yeah. And, uh, by the way, you probably see that the uh, button to actually continue on with the dialogue is the circle button. That is because the circle button is the accept button in uh, in Japan, and the uh, X button is actually the, uh, well, the cancel button. So they didn't change that here, but it's no big deal, really. Hey! Stop kicking the poor guy! <laughs> Can't you talk? Could, be a, could he be a stowaway? <laughs> nah, you think? A guy sleeping in the storeroom. Can he be a stowaway? <laughs> sure seems like it. Hey, do you hear me? He's still half asleep. Well, you're coming with us, buddy. <laughs> this always looks so funny to me. <laughs> They're actually dragging him while he's sleeping. Oh, that was bad. Hey, wake up already! Come on, get the lead out! Jeez, stop kicking his ass, he's asleep! Huh? What? Just walk! Okay. <laughs> oh, this is hilarious. And I actually also really like the music. It, it feels... Um, it feels like it's something urgent is going on, but... It really, really is really not. <laughs> Captain! What is it? What is this? Ra all this racket? Sir, we found this suspicious character. He was hiding in the storeroom below. What? Hiding below? Oh, damn. Who are you? Huh? What? Stop kicking him, sheesh! The captain asked you a question. Who are you? I, um, I'm <clears throat> Stan Eileron. Where are you from? I'm from the village of Liana in Fitzgold. We'll take that sword. Uh, uh, sure. So they're gonna steal his weapon, huh? So they stole the sword of the sword wielding main character. Oh no, whatever shall he do? He doesn't appear to have anything suspicious other than the sword. <sighs> the Draconis is my ship. Why are you here? I... I... I only wanted the passage to Singald. Or however you say it. Eh, whatever. Liar! You come to steal it, haven't you? It? All I want is the passage to Singald. Please, believe me. Well, if we're going to play dumb, we can play games too. Maybe we can use him as a punching bag. Do whatever you need to make him talk. Aye aye, Captain! Wait! What are you doing? S stop Tell us the truth! Uh, ow! Ow! I don't know what you're talking about, honest! You're only making things worse for yourself. Come on, tell us what you know. Uh, you came looking for it in the storeroom, didn't you? I have a feeling they don't want me to steal it. <laughs> I really don't know. Shut up and spit it out. 
Ow. And if you think that the uh, the scream sounds a little Japanese, it's because the voice acting in this game is indeed Japanese. Ugh, my aching head. Oh great, just what you need. Just what we need. A stowaway. You just figured that out now <laughs> that he's a stowaway? Not a thief? Okay. What a pain. What now, Captain? Get him out of here. Aye, sir. And make him swap the deck or something. C come on, come on, get up. Move it, slacker. Cypher, slifer slacker. Though he doesn't have any red on him. Are you alright? How can I be alright? I just got caught and beaten up. Beaten up. Like a punching bag. <laughs> yeah, good point, good point. Well, Ed, today's your unlucky day. Smuggling yourself aboard a time like this. What do you mean, unlucky? Are you dumb? Haven't you figured it out by now that this ship is transporting something important? Yeah, you guys aren't really, um... Well, you're, you're, you're pretty bad at hiding stuff, you know? You come to steal it, haven't you? It, it, we have an it on this boat, or ship, or... What is this, anyway? That's why, that's why everyone's a bit jumpy. Oh, I see. The captain isn't usually like that. Sure he isn't. <laughs> I don't believe you. That's enough. Let's get going. Okie dokie. So, what's Stan gonna do now, anyway? Whoa, what the... Uh... Ah, the Draconis. Okay, this is... Um... Awesome on so many levels. Something's not right. I can feel it. What? What are you talking about? Move along and don't try anything. Yes, sir! <laughs> I like this guy. Stan is a very good protagonist, I feel. And I'm sorry for the for the lag. I, I, I'm real I really am. Alright, stowaway, stop swabbing. Make sure you don't do anything stupid like uh, falling off the deck. <laughs> uh, <laughs> falling off? There's nothing we can do to help you if you fall off the deck. Remember that. Uh, uh, sure. Now then, let's get your mop. The mop is over there, next to the edge. Oh, you're so mean. <laughs> wait, a, wait just a sec. I don't think I'm really cut out for this. Or, uh, cut out for. What are you babbling about? B because we're s so high up in the air. Yeah? So what? Of course, we're high up in the air. We're on the deck of the Draconis. Well, I I I'm kind of scared. Yeah, sure you are. Remember, you're dead if you fall. <laughs> you're really not helping. Well, um... Uh... <laughs> Come on, don't be a wimp. You won't fall unless you try real hard. Hey, that's easy for you to s Stop your rat yapping and start your cleaning. Uh, sheesh, what's the matter with you? Here, swap this deck first. You can get used to the heights bit by bit. Fine. Oh, God. Here, take this mop. Now, I'll admit, if that was me, I would probably jump. Yeah, I hate cleaning. <laughs> just that much! <laughs> you should see my room, yeah. I'm just kidding. Hey kid, you're a natural! Oh, you ass. <laughs> Gee, thanks. Uh. <laughs> I like the humor in this game already. Captain, something approaches. Something's approaching on an intercept vector. Range 300 and closing. They're, they're monsters! How many are there? Sir, there are approximately 100. Now it reached 250. 20 seconds inter inter intercept. Those bastards have finally found us. Number one, sound the alert. Battle stations. Aye, sir. Battle stations. Man your battle stations. All hats. Man your battle stations. And you, go to engineering. Increased lens generator power input. To plus 120% so we can shake them. Aye, Captain, let's go, follow me. Aye, sir. We can't allow it to 
fall into their hands. We got to protect it somehow. Increase power. Okay, they are very jumpy. Full power. Aye, aye, sir. And this thing always bugged me a little bit. Is this supposed to be the heart of the Draconis? Like the heart of the dragon or something? Kind of looks like it. And poor Stan. <laughs> What's the alarm for? I'm not sure. Something must have happened. You think? Oh boy. Drak! <laughs> m, m monsters Behind you! Watch your back! What? Oh! Ouch. <laughs> Time to die. Don't worry, I'll make sure your death will be painful. Now, this is a little bit... I, I always wondered, why did they say monster? Because this is clearly just a guy with a bear pelt or something on his head. I mean, is it like, you killed a bear, you monster, or... I don't really know, because we're gonna kill some bears pretty soon, so... Are we monsters too? <laughs> okay, I'm thinking too, too much over this. Anyway, what do you mean my turn? Not if I can help it. Bye. Damn! I don't have a weapon! <laughs> You're all talk, aren't you, little man? Beep! <laughs> All I need is a weapon. I'll make monster mincemeat out of them, if I had one. Okay, I just need to be calm. And find a weapon somewhere. Can there be a weapon on this boat anyway? I don't know. So, yeah, we are finally in control of Stan. And the controls are pretty much what you'd expect. You move around with the... Uh, with the directional buttons. Not the analog stick for some reason. I am playing this with a PlayStation 3 controller. And I tried, but I didn't get to do it. Press the X button to dash around, and Stan is incredibly fast. And I go down here, and you see there's a monster here. A monster! I can't fight them without any weapons. Okay, so, uh, of course, triangle button will take you to the menu, and if you go into uh, Stan's equipment, you see he doesn't have weapons, so he can't fight. And he also doesn't have any skills, but I'm not gonna go over that yet. We need to find a weapon. And fast. Or else, we are big are gonna become mincemeat. And I always thought that looked pretty cool, that he hit the guy and he fell down the stairs, and when the guys just run around with the monster after them, I thought it looks pretty hilarious. Anyway, check the dead guy. I finished. Get the sword from the storeroom. Okay, thanks for that hint. So there is a weapon in here, in the storeroom, so we should probably go and get that, and we have a guy hiding on the toilet. In the bathroom, anyone? Anyone? <laughs> Stay away! Uh, okay. So maybe we should hide in the toilet too. I don't think so. Anyway, you would. We. Instead, you want to check the toilet. Hey, there's something on the floor. Do you want to pick it up? I'm not sure, but. Yeah, sure, why not? And we get a green gel that's in the toilet. Yeah. Not really sure. I wonder if it's okay to eat. Yeah. I I wonder too. <laughs> anyway, the green gel is this game's apple gel. Heals 30% of a character's HP. So, yeah, pretty nice, but we can't really use it right now since we are not in a battle. Anyway, let's see. He's taking his last breath. And we got a cloak. Which we stole from a dead body. Anyway. The cloak is a, of course, a very starting-ish type of armor. It's a bad armor, but any armor is better than no armor, so I'm gonna take it anyway. <laughs> oh no, what's this? The pad is blocked by crates, but I think I can move them. Yeah, yeah, we can go in here, by the way. So, of course, press the circle button to move the crates out of the way. You see, Button Kaitos? It's really not that hard. Have a button that you so you can actually grab onto stuff instead of just well ramming the stuff with your face when you want to when you want to uh, push anything out of the way. I still I'm, I will never let that go. <laughs> that was horrible. Anyway, check this uh, table with fruit on it, and you will get an apple. 
Okay, not bad. And there's a guy hiding in here. Let's see. F fool! Get away! You're going to lead. You're going to lead the monsters, monsters to me. Well, sorry. Sheesh! I just want to hide or get a weapon or whatever comes first. Oh man. Okay, we really need to find this weapon. So let's go into the storeroom to see. Hey, what's that? Convenient blinking in the dark, huh? Something shining over there. Okay, let's go over there and get it. And I will let this episode be a little long. I mean, it's the opening after all. So what is that thing? Oh, it's that sword from the intro, huh? It looks kind of... beat up. Oh well, my sword's a sword. Oh god, that was horrible. Great, a weapon! Whoa, what a piece of junk! Well, I guess I can't complain. A piece of junk? <laughs> well, wh who is it? Uh, who said that? My name is Dimlos. I'm the sword you hold in your hand. The, the sword spoke! Calm down, you fool. I'll protect you from the enemy. What? P protect me? Look in front of you. They're coming. And... I got you now! Give it to me! And we have our first battle. And, I know, it's not supposed to be a completely black screen. It's supposed to twirl around, but I can't do that on this emulator. Anyway, of course, the battle, in this battle system in this game is very... Straightforward. Yeah, in the beginning, the battle system in this game is incredibly slow, since we don't have any skills or anything. And this is probably the time that the game is gonna lag the most. The victory post screen. Yeah, that's the one that lags the most. Did I just do that? Not bad for the novice, but oh, never mind. So, what's your name? What? Oh, sorry, it's uh, Stan Alron. Now, Stan, air, something. <laughs> or another. You're powerless, so I've given you a spell. Ooh, harsh reality, in your face. A, a spell? What do you mean? I've given you the spell called Fireball. We actually did have it in the battle too, but since Dimlos didn't tell us until now, I thought, I'm not gonna use it. This spell enables you to shoot small fireballs at your enemies. Remember, you must always have me, a swordian, to cast a spell. By the way, it won't be easy for you to master them. What do you mean by that? You'll see for yourself in time. Anyway, hurry up and get out of here now. You're finished with this place. Okay, okay, I hear you, but... Say, wait a minute. What now? What do you mean, what now? You call yourselves Dimlos, right? You're a sword for crying out loud! No, I'm a teapot. Of course I'm a sword. <laughs> oh, I love that line. One of my favorites in the game, actually. No, I'm a teapot. <laughs> How in the world can you speak? I can speak because I'm alive. Ah, oh, come on. Do you expect me to believe that? Right now, I don't care if you believe me or not. What matters is that I'm here before you. Have you ever heard about the Aether Wars? I was born in that distant past. And now I have reawakened. And, I've chosen, and I have chosen you as my master. Do you understand me? Uh, understand you? Uh, I will help you with my powers. Believe what I say. If you don't want to die, that is. Hmm, <laughs> okay, so either believing in a talking sword or dying. Yeah, I think I'm gonna go with the sword. Anyway, so Stan finally got a weapon, and uh, for those has, that has been following my LPs so far, or Tails LPs, you might remember the uh, SD that we have gotten both in Fantasia and Eternia. And for those who don't know or haven't figured it out or anything, this is the SD. Sordian Dimlos. So, uh, is it gonna be a awesome summon that lets me summon my party members in this game? Okay, that doesn't really make sense. 
Or is it gonna be the strongest sword in the game? Except it's gonna be overshadowed by a different sword because of its element? Well, let's check it out! Five slash and... What the hell happened with my SD? You're the signature sword of the main character! They got five slash and five thrust. It's also fire elemental, but still, five? Oh, man. And I have to have this sword equipped to actually cast spells? Really? How do you expect me to do that? It's so weak. Well, okay, fine. I'm gonna stop playing with you now. And I'm gonna say that Dimlos will actually level up when Stan does. So, uh, it's gonna get stronger. <laughs> so, uh, it's got, it will probably be the strongest sword in the game once again, yes. But, uh... Are we even gonna get out of this place and... Well, how? I mean, we're high up in the sky. The soldier guy said so. If, if we fall, we are pretty much dead. So, uh... We probably... Sh we should probably find a different way to get away from this ship. So, uh... Next time... Let's hope we... Won't die. Yeah, that's, uh... Really hard to get, but, uh... Let's hope we don't die. <laughs> So, I thank you all for watching, and I see you all then.